Hey gents, today we're taking a first look at Huru, which is a new bag launching on Kickstarter. If you're watching this video, it just launched. So if you want to get in on some of the early bird stuff, it's like $249 right now, and then you can go to $299. But I just want to do an unboxing, give a first look, and give some of my impressions on the Huru. It was really of interest to me because at heart I am an Eagle Scout and a camper and adventurer. And I've always been interested in like the Osprey bags where you go pack camping and backpacking in, but a lot of those aren't going to look good if you wear them to uh, an office or if you wear them somewhere that you want to look a little bit more professional. And so this seems to take everything that you love about the functionality of Osprey and those kind of hiking bags, but puts it into a more professional type of look. Uh, and so let's take a look at the Huru. This, the first thing here, this is a custom designed aluminum buckle. Uh, and then the Huru itself will do between 24 to 40 liters of capacity because it does have an expansion. You can check out the Kickstarter for all the features, but just at a high level, it is completely water repellent. It is a Cordura fabric, so it's military grade fabric. It's got these custom designed machined aluminum buckles. It has a real leather case, or it has a real leather base to it. It has uh, this, this laptop bag. It's got a detachable sling bag. It's just a crazy functionality. Uh, it reminds me a lot of some of the rucksacks that I've looked that in the past uh, and but for $2.99 I mean that's a pretty good price for a bag of this type of engineering so let's take a look uh, I had it upside I had it upside down okay completely empty it is five and a half pounds so it's not the lightest bag but with all of the functionality built into it uh, I'm not that surprised and so from a material standpoint that feels very solid. And you can see right on the site they have, uh, you know, if you put anything in here, it's, this isn't something you're gonna jump into the water uh, and, and have it completely water resistant, but if you're in, out in the rain, uh, water repellent. But then there's also a rain sleeve, that I believe, that pops out of here. Yeah, there you go. So here's a rain hood if you're caught in uh, inclement weather. Wow, super lightweight. These buckles are incredible. I think most of the weight comes from the aluminum of these buckles. Very, very solid. All right, so we have secret compartment pockets in here for like your wallet, uh, or money, or passport. Real leather handle up here. This is a rolling bag so that you can put in something, I think they mentioned like a tennis racket, but for oversized items that don't fit inside. Let's see, it should have a nice, huge capacity in here. Oh yeah. Yep, we get, there's a laptop sleeve over on the side here that'll fit up to a 15 inch laptop. And then this whole shell where the back is, is a plastic shell to you know protect your spine. And then you've got nice big uh, side, oh is this, this is the bag. Aha. Uh -huh. So there's a detachable sling bag. Look at that. I'd say fanny pack, not quite like a fanny pack, but you could just, uh, you know, this has a nice size to it here where you could put uh, just some small stuff. And then right around here, a nice small pack. Check that out. Yeah, I have a couple of Osprey bags and uh, I don't have any that are quite this, quite this engineered or this built. So uh, yeah, you got water repellent zippers up here. These are a solid YKK zipper. I mean, you can just feel it on the smoothness of it and they have leather accents. And uh, so yeah, I'd say if you're in the market for a bag like this, wow, Huru, Huru really nails it. And uh, I just, I could do this machined aluminum buckle all day. It's pretty nice. For scale and for testing, this is my Tumi uh, Alpha Bravo bag, which I use every day. Fully loaded, uh, my daily carry, it's about 15 pounds, almost 20 pounds. Uh, so I can actually fit it inside of the Huru. Because I did want, I want to see how the Huru feels fully uh, loaded up. So this is the unexpanded Huru, can fit my Tumi bag. Uh, and then the expansion compartment of the Huru would make it considerably bigger. So there you have it, gents. I would say an A-plus on the Huru if you're looking for a bag of this design and this technical nature. I like can't get over the machined aluminum buckles here. They're like super solid, and I really like that. And it's just tons of pockets, tons of compartments, and, uh, oh, that's 
forgot. Yeah, this leather, this leather is nice too. So really cool technical bag. I also like the little sling because you don't have to take everything all the time. Uh, and the material, just it, overall, I think it's a solid bag, especially in that $299 price point. So uh, the Kickstarter is live. I think it's $249 for the earliest birds, and then $299 I think is where a lot of people will fall. And then I would bet this bag at full price if I had to guess based on like rucksacks and ospreys and other bags I've looked at is going to be in that 350 to $400 range and so you get a good deal on the Kickstarter but even then uh, at full price this is going to be a, a great value because this is a lifetime bag. They do offer a lifetime warranty so if you do pick one up uh, you can be certain that it will be covered for any of the you know normal wear and tear things and uh, pretty cool. You can check that out on a Kickstarter if you're looking for one of those. And that is your sneak peek into the Huru. If you have any questions, I'll do my best to answer down below. I've got this bag here, and I'll try to do my best uh, with anything you have. And until next time, gents, this is the Cavalier.